Okay, let me show it. Okay, the nogi. Okay, stay natural. And the So question? <laughs> Can you do a flower? Oh yeah. Okay. So one more time. And then I go here. And then oh. one more time. Okay. So in judo, this is called uchimata. Okay. So that's good. This is called uchimata. So in judo. And basically you grip the lapel and the sweep, right? But now there's no there's no lapel, but you can still grab the wrist, this arm. So and for this technique, let's grab yeah on the wrist. Okay, this is too high. Not the elbow, right? Not the elbow, but let's grab at the wrist. Okay, so like not on the bottom, okay? But so grab like on top like this. And your right right arm, you know, instead of grabbing, gripping the lapel, just hook under his armpit. It's fit. Right? It's fit. Like this. And that and then so basically, you know what I did was from here, I turn and then I hook his leg. Here. So you can stay close. Okay? Don't stay like a fog. Let's stay close. Stay close, stay close. And then from the close position, you still step in. So step and so bring your, your left leg on the side. Not in. So one and two. My left foot comes out here. So you could do this, but this is a little bit, you know, modified for uh, nogi. So here, step to bring your left foot on the side next to his uh, uh, left foot. So one, so one, two, and you're going to hop uh, this part. And of course, you know, kick up high. You know, uh, the higher you kick, better, of course, right? Not just, uh, not like this, but you want to kick up high as you can. Okay, so here, one and two, two steps, okay? Like one fluid motion, right? So here, one and two, okay? Now, like, uh, one, two, three, you know? You don't want to take that like, one, two, three. But like almost one, two, three. One, two, three. I mean, one, almost two steps. You know, looks like two steps. One and two. And kick up high. At the same time, you're going to twist, twist his body and twist your body and pull him down. I like guess. Twist. You're going to throw him, like, not here, but here. So here, I'm going to twist my body, my core, this, this area, twist to finish my throw. This way. Okay, so you have to stay close, first of all. There's a lot of space, for example. If there's a lot of space here, oh, nine, not. Ah! You know, too far. So before you attack, let's get closer first. Okay, let's get close. Before, you get, let's get close. And now this is good, you know, good for this technique. You're supposed to be close already before you attack. So here, get this, get into this position first. And you can pressure a little bit, right? Pressure to get close. Stay close, stay close, stay close. And step one, two. And twist. Twist the body. Like here. Yes. So any questions so far? Alright, 
Oh yes, go ahead. Is there a hip contact? Hmm, no hip contact this time. So you're not gonna use a hip. You're not gonna use hip, you know, hips. But like mm, this area it touches like almost mm, not the hip not the hip to hip, but my hip is you know close to his leg. And so but this is actually not the uh, hip throw, okay? It's not the hip throw, this is a hip throw. But my hips come out here. So not the, you know, no hip contact for this time. I modify a little bit, okay? So, yeah, this is Ogos, right? This is a hip throw, this is called Ogos. But uh, today, it's not like hip throw, but more leg, okay, more leg. You're gonna kick your leg really, you know, kick up high. Again, you know, the, the higher you kick, better, of course. So, All right, guys, come back. So, first, okay, so you wanna twist the body as you can, okay? Here, and twist the body. So, Okay, as you twist, okay, look where you know you're throwing. So if you keep facing that way, for example, my body, that's his turn. You know what I mean? So let's look look at the where you're throwing like this. So here, so here, then so your body you know turns naturally. So again, you you're gonna look, you're gonna look at where you're throwing. So look at here. Like, you know, my uh, my face comes like here. And then look here. Not, don't look down. Okay, look there. So, your body really turns. You know what I mean? Okay, that's one thing. And then another thing, so, as you kick. So some of you are kicking like here. Right, kicking like sideways, you know what I mean? Okay, one, two, and three like this. Like right, kicking sideways like this. You know, you can't keep your balance if you if you kick sideways like this. Instead, you know, get in and kick backwards, just straight. Straight backwards this way. Not like not sideways. Uh, okay, so one, two, and then kick. You know, exactly backwards. The last one, your body. As you finish, you can you can bend your back. Okay? Not like this. Here. Not like this. Okay? Sweep. As you sweep, bend your back. Bend your back. Like this. Twist. And bend. Not. Not like this. So now, what we're gonna do is the so pressure and cause the push back. So push back. Now, from here, he's pushing back. And you switch and throw. This is a, one of the best timing for you. Pressure, pressure. You know, if I put pressure on his body, he's gonna push back. And now for twist. Okay, so you're gonna switch the direction. That way. He's coming towards you. Use his reaction for you to throw. The same direction. That was a practice. <laughs> 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 <laughs>